I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is six simple machines. I'm going to write up here six simple machines. And we're going to draw first and then we'll talk. Starting way over here on the left, I'm going to put a dot and I'm going to draw a straight line up, straight diagonal down, straight diagonal down, connect. Right at this point, I draw a straight line down, come up here, draw a straight line down, and now with a straight line, connect the two. This is a wedge wedge. Another way of looking at it. Come over here, put a dot. Let's draw a straight line, straight diagonal down, straight diagonal up, connect. We're going to put a straight line out, straight line down and leave it floating. Straight line out, straight line down, leave it floating. This is also a wedge. But this is a wedge in place for splitting something in half. So I'm going to draw a curved line and a triangle going down and a curved line and a triangle going out. So if you hit the wedge, these pieces would fall to the other side. Okay. Now come down here and we're just going to put a dot. And I'm going to draw a straight line down straight diagonal up, straight line down, straight diagonal up, and connect. Right underneath, in the center, straight diagonal out, straight line, straight diagonal up, connect. This is a lever. A lever. And if you put a weight on this side going down, it's going to make this side go up. Triangle, straight line. Okay? Now, come straight down below and we're just going to draw a half curve line, straight line, connect. We're going to draw a straight diagonal, straight diagonal, straight line, connect. Come over here on the left, put a dot, and we're going to draw a curve line, jump over, curve line, down, come back to the left, let's draw a straight line, connect. Inside, we're going to draw a curve line, connect, curve line, connect. This is also a lever, but this one has a handle, so you can pull down, straight curve line, triangle, <clears throat> excuse me, or you can go the opposite direction, curve line, triangle. Okay? <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> right here, I'm going to put a dot, and I'm going to draw a baby circle, and then I'm going to draw a bigger circle, and then I'm going to draw that circle again. This is probably the most important simple machine. I'm going to put one, two straight lines, one, two straight lines, one, two straight lines, one, two straight lines, one, two straight lines. These are called animation lines, two little curved lines, two little curved lines. <clears throat> and this is the wheel, a major simple machine that changed the course of our lives. Come straight down over here. Put a dot, straight line, straight line, straight line, straight line, connect. Come to this corner, straight diagonal up, straight line, straight diagonal down, connect. This corner, straight line down, straight diagonal, connect. Now, <clears throat> again, let's draw a straight diagonal, bam, it crashes into that, jump over, continue your line. Now draw a straight diagonal out, <clears throat> come back to the bottom, straight diagonal over, 
Now we're going to draw a straight diagonal up, straight line down, straight line over, connect. Straight line inside, and here's our triangle to show movement. This is called an inclined, inclined plane. And when you have this configuration, your motion can go down. It can go up, but it's easier to go down. Okay? Come over here to this section right here. Put a dot. And we're going to draw a curve line. Slightly curve line connect. Mimic that line. Curve line. Straight line down. Straight diagonal. Straight line down. Straight diagonal connect little curve lines inside come up to the top curve line curve line curve line curve line connect this time we're going to have the movement go around and this is a screw okay <clears throat> i think i'm getting a cold all right now come over to this space and let's just draw a baby rectangle in about midpoint we're going to put a curved line. Starting at the top, we're going to draw a curved line, straight line back up, <clears throat> on the right, left, and on the right, curved line, zigzag, curved line back up. This can go in this direction, curved line, triangle, or this direction, curved line, triangle. And this is a pulley. Okay, let's see how we're going to color these in. All right, as we color, I'm going to talk a little bit. So the wedge, I'm making red. We're going to keep them real simple colors. And these six simple machines are important because it helped people learn how to build. Now, if you take the same wedge and you put it inside, like hammer it or axe it into another piece of wood this is how they would split so that they could have more materials next I'm going to take yellow for my lever this is two examples of levers this top one is the easiest this one you see more often on machines that are already built because it has that handle so I'm using yellow for that part and then I'm using blue green a contrasting color so you can see how it moves or the parts so that's blue-green next wheel super important this was for transportation just for everything once you figured out how to use a wheel you could go anywhere super important simple machine somebody figured it out so I'm making that red. Now my incline plane. This was important for moving things. So I'm going to take my yellow and make this space yellow. And then I'm going to do the actual incline purple. So you can see it. Okay. Now I take my yellow again. Super simple machine but made a difference. Screws made all the difference in the world. Things wouldn't slip anymore. And finally, a pulley. Equally, if you wanted to move something from A to point B and it was heavy, you would connect it and hold it and pull the pulley part so that you could move your object. And it's really interesting that all of these simple machines made a major difference in our lives. <clears throat> all right, I'm going to use green to draw all the little animation arrows. You can use whatever colors you want for all of this. But this is so that you see how the machines move and work. Okay? Really fascinating. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. 
Okay, here are my six simple machines all colored in. Okay, 